Joe Biden, Kamala Harris bumper sticker. You know what that means? There's probably an ignorant, brainwashed liberal driving the car with a mask. In three, two, one, I was right! Tell us about it. You look gorgeous. Tell us about beautiful, all these beautiful... Why are you looking down? Look up. Beautiful trans women out here. Tell us about your transition, how it went. Can I hold this, please? No. Um, so I have a question for you. Why are you asking me those questions? Uh, we're, 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 uh, we're... In, Wait, what are you doing? We're interviewing people at Pride. Okay. Like we're interviewing like trans women and stuff like that. I'm not a trans woman. I'm a. Oh no no we're we're fully supportive, fully okay. supportive. Yeah yeah. So we just want to like talk about like the transitions, like I'm the various offended. challenges we've had. I am not offended or anything like that. Okay, yeah um, yeah for sure. So ask me about a question. Uh, do you want to talk about sort of transitioning or anything like that, or like what I people can? I never transition because I was born a woman. No, of course you're a woman, of course. I was born a woman. Yeah. Does it does it make it? Um, yeah, you're, I I completely agree. I'm not I'm not here challenging that at all. We're like out here. The whole thing is like being proud and it's like supporting. Does make a trans woman it. any less of a woman? No, you are a woman. That's what I'm saying. No, no. Uh, does it make a trans woman any no. less of a woman? No, you are 100 percent a woman. Uh, does a is a trans woman any less? No, 100 percent. All women are women. Trans okay. women, all women, and like I I think you are as much of a woman. As what any is your other opinion on trans women? I support them and I love them. Okay. Like I'm, that's why we're interviewing them. We're showcasing them. Like oh well, you them. haven't interviewed one yet because I'm not a trans woman. Okay. Is there another definition that people like to use, or am um, I? I don't I mean to be. I was born a woman. I was born with female genitals. Okay. okay so. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. Now she knows the difference between a woman and a trans woman. I hate when I see the traditional people. Like her claiming that trans women are women. Now she can define a woman. She has a female genitals. And it's crazy when I see people, woke people with this woke virus thing and claiming that anyone can be a woman because it's pure delusion. What an idiot! I'm so gay, I eat for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. What did he say? Oh, I'm not sexual. How much have you taken? Like four, five, fifty of them. <laughs> Yeah, me too. No shame. How many? Like 50. How many you took? How many you took? Like, like, like 10 for the boys. 10 oh, yeah! 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 Okay, so. This, this is disgusting. For you to see black men. Don't call me racist, but like, it's, 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 I feel, these people have lost their roots. Like, they've lost their culture. They, like, they really don't understand anything about their culture anymore because it's disgusting. For you to see black man actually saying he have gotten 50 dick. I really don't believe this. Like, I honestly believe this is a prank or something. Like, I, I don't believe this. Do you agree or disagree with the following statement? It is okay to be white. No, that's not, that's not okay. It's terrible to be white. Who wants to be white? That's awful. Why is it not okay to be white? We all have done too much. As, I would rather... people? Yeah, as a whole. Too much good or too much bad? Too much bad. What should white people do about that? Try not to be white. <laughs> <laughs> so you just don't like white people as a whole? No. Yeah, I am racist. Are you serious? Or are you? Hundred percent. At least she's honest, and I hate when I see people saying that white people have done a lot. And bro, like, think about it. We sort of, even if I would say we're not compensated fairly, but like, black people sold themselves, and white people are also slaves. So you saying white is this? Slavery was a normal norm. You go on a jail. <laughs> You're going going again. Again. Can men menstruate? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. This is a scary question. Yes. Yes. I would say yes. No. No. What do you think? <laughs> no. Yeah. I'd yeah. say so. We're not going to answer the question. Why is that? I feel like you're you're trying for us to say something controversial, but we're not going to get involved. Is it? Okay, so it's a controversial question? I don't know. What the hell is wrong with you people? Can men menstruate? Can men what? F no. No. Get the period? No. What Are the f Man, we, not, we don't think like that. And it's only two genders. That's what I'm talking about! Yes, like, there are only two genders. I hate when I see people trying to, like, say things just because they want other people to feel good. Now, like, let's be honest. There are only two genders, and men can never menstruate. And it's... I am not ashamed to say it's like it's a fact so I'm just stating fact here. Yeah. This is a fat club. Um, I'm, I'm queer and fat. Okay, thank you for joining. We're just um, introducing ourselves at the moment. Okay. 
Do you want to go ahead and introduce yourself, Joe? Yeah, uh, my name's Joe. I go by he, they, and uh, I identify as 275 pounds. Okay, okay. Um, I feel like Jay's kind of making fun of me, though. I know it's kind of a shock. I know, kind of a new thing. I'm, I'm just, you know, monk. Do what? I said I apologize. Oh, no, you're good. Um, Are you comfortable leaving the group at the moment? Why? Why? I'm, I'm not understanding why you're joining the group. This is the fat group now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's what I came here for. Okay. Um, and you said you identify as fat? Yeah. <laughs> Got him. When you flip the coin at what people, they see how delusional this sound and they're like, we don't want to be part of this. And it's really, really annoying when you see people saying, we want to accept everyone. And let's say you come to their yeah, space. Now they feel triggered. Like me, President Trump, you know, I have some of the most highest amount of threats because of people like you because you choose to only take certain words from people and then that's what you want to report shame on you shame on you because you, no, no, no 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 you're the, you're the problem and where's this woman from the, the times time. you're London. from the times okay you're ridiculous and you're the problem in our country you lie about people like me this is the first time you've ever talked to me i want you to know i'm i'm a regular person like you i'm also a mom i have three kids and we have to put up with the most unreal amount of bullshit because of little liars like you that take your job and turn it into political activism. Your job is the press. You should report the news, not li no, 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 not lie about it. You don't get to ask any more questions. I'm done with you okay. because you're the cause. You're One the cause thing, you of our the country. No, no, no. You're the cause of our country being divided. You're the cause of our country being divided. You're the cause of President Trump almost being assassinated. You're the cause of everything wrong well, in America. Evidence for these claims? No, no, you're done. You're done. Yeah, go okay. back. Thank go you. Back. It's JD Vince. When you say what places I can't answer your question, they attack you and run. Uh, you pick bear. Why is that? Because in some cases, the bear can be safer than the man. So, what do you think the chances are that the man would opt to victimize you? Uh, I would say probably like. 40%? 40%. I got a question. So if we go to any zoo in the world that has a bear enclosure, why are none of the women jumping into the enclosure to escape <laughs> from the men? If me and Nick were the two men here in the studio, if we just transformed into bears right now, do you guys think you'd be safer? If you were in a bathroom, would you rather a man or a bear wanders in? <laughs> if there was a bear in your home, would you call animal control? And a man would show up. Potentially. <laughs> Potentially. Yep. That's a good point. That's true. All right. Anyways. Anyways. <laughs> moving on. Moving on. That's funny. Case closed. Uh, a man would show up to take the bear. Mm. Oh, Maddie, could you see, it's, it's crazy when you see women that think like this. Like, you, you just... You ask yourself, like... Where do you grow up? Like, it, it's sad. Are you a Biden supporter? Uh, I, I am. Why? He's better than the alternative. You don't think he's, like, senile, though, and, like, he can't yeah, lead a country? I, 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 don't, I, th I think he's in bad shape, but I, I, I would still rather have him, or at least th th then replace him with someone else. But even if someone else is more competent? If someone else is more competent, that's even better. You don't think Trump's more competent than Biden? Uh, I hate Trump. Why? Why? Because he's a terrible human being. How so? Uh, just is, man. I was talking to a friend earlier yesterday, and he says he hates Trump. I was like, why? He said Trump want to close the border. I was like, this, this is stupid. Like, to be honest, it's stupid. It does not make sense. My body! My body! My body! My body! My body! Would you be okay with your mother taking drugs and drinking alcohol while pregnant? Of course not. But that's not the point. Not her body, not her choice, I guess. Look, I've got a question for you. You are contradicting yourself by saying she can't drink alcohol and take drugs. Why not? Because it's medically proven that it can affect the baby. There's no sperm that's involved. No. You can have a baby without a man. You can and learn no how to look that. You can educate yourself right now and, and look that no up. Sperm. But you're refusing. And no sperm. You can literally look that up right now. You're more worried about laughing in your camera and recording me than doing a quick Google search to educate yourself. So why don't you?
you inform me. I How just can did. I, no, no, no. Don't say Google You can it. take two eggs from IVF and make a baby. You can gladly Google that, but you don't want to. None of you have done it. <laughs> Guys, I, I, I don't believe this is true. Like, see, I, I don't believe this. This, this can't, this can't be true. Like, we see, we have not gotten, nah, we are not this bad yet. Like, let me, let, let me just stop you so you don't waste a line of questioning. I'm just giving you. <laughs> I love the mansplaining. I'm enjoying it. You're loving what? The mansplaining that's going on. What's what? Well, just mean? talking me through how how what you, well what you, what by you, not answering the question what you, what you, what you, what you by repeating suggesting? processes which are not related to the question that I've asked. What's, what's mansplaining, what's Senator? Well, it's the slightly patronising and condescending way that you're responding to my questions. Well, I would suggest, Senator, that if you're putting the word man in front of uh, some description of what I'm doing, you're doing that which I'm sure you're very much against, is making a, a sexist implication about how I'm conducting my role well, as a man. Well, then the easiest is that way what, to do is it... That what, is that well, what you're saying, Senator? Well, what I'm saying is that the way you've been responding to me has been patronising and condescending, and I have responded to that. So the easiest by, by, way to deal with this is not, imagine, is, not ima to, imagine, Senator, is not to imagine to have that way in responding to the questions I've asked. Imagine the reaction, Senator, if I said you were woman splaining. You're saying that I'm mansplaining. Well, it is a term that's used. Is it when, by whom? Well, by it rude, is a term that's used. By rude. Doesn't doesn't make By rude senators. Uh, by senators no. who are seeking to make gender an issue. Stop being a hypocrite. Well, Conduct yourself it. appropriately for this well, place. I'm sorry you're so offended by the use of the word. It is it is a word that's used. Uh, it's it's a. I'm surprised that you're so shocked by the use of the word. No, I'm just um, I'm just calling hypocrisy. Hypocrisy. Well, thy name yes. is Labor. Thy name is Senator Gallagher. <laughs> Got him. I really don't get the reason why I should use that word on him. And I feel where women are feeling attacked like they just want to throw something up there like to hold your feelings too if a girl has slept with 10 guys she's called a <laughs> but if a guy does it what would you call him probably gay what what is this why does it say one man and one woman i'm the happiest man in the world why does your sign say one man and one I'm woman i'm 100 gay why does your sign say one man and one woman because this is the right natural way what does that mean i don't know what, what it, why are you I having think word, words are being Words don't mean Turn anything around. today. In any shape I'm or not form? a racist either. Well, you're a black bigot. No, no, no. I'm a white lesbian. Y'all know what's going on. And so do I. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Address me as a white lesbian. Oh. I'm not black. A boy could be a girl. And a girl could be a boy. So if I want, I'm not black. You got me. <laughs> so if you talk to me, you address me as a white lesbian. Okay, white lesbian. Okay, now we can talk. Okay. Yeah. Right? How, how is a black man, how could you be how such a How can a white lesbian I will love you, you and tell you the truth. I am not I racist. Will not lie to you. Yes, you, you are the are. stupidest you, human you, you I have are. met. Okay. Okay. So I will I You're will a love human. You I'm a tell, human. And I will you tell will you the love truth. no one. I will love you and tell no. you the truth. I won't lie to you. You're a hate. People spider. that are afraid of you lie to you. I love the way he pulled out the work coin, like he flipped it on them and like they see how stupid it sounds. Because you see, he cannot call him white when he's claiming that he's a black man. It does not make sense, like it means you have to be, you want to act stupid. This is why you see some people saying, yo, I'm a woman without some physical changes. I want people to call you a woman. It does not make sense. And even if you have some physical changes, you're still a man. So you just can't be a woman because you can call yourself a trans woman, but like, you're not a woman. Like, it's it's a fact. Did you know that all three of Megan Fox's sons are trans? And she's been dressing them as girls since they were like one. Oh, Who damn. What is, and their last name's like Coyote now? now? Oh, my God. Yeah. And they're all bi. They were and born they're by. They're all boys. They're yeah. all born boys? Yeah. Yo, that's some fucked up shit, bro. Damn. That that's makes me up. feel like. That's Megan Fox dark. is up in there being like, put the tutu on, bitch. Yeah, 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 <laughs> you know yeah, yeah. what I mean? Like, was it free will or is she forcing them to be trans? No, this, this, I mean, three. She took Transformers way too far. Yeah. <laughs> 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 That's the funniest shit you can do. <laughs> Guys, she took Transformers way too far. It's crazy. Like, that, that was cool. But, like, I'll say this some people are not supposed to ever give birth. Like, some people are not supposed to have children don't if you know you're not mentally ready don't like 
you don't you don't need it don't, don't stress yourself because like you've ruined your life don't try ruin another person's life like just don't have kids i prefer really not to um, not to speak if i speak i am in in big trouble my entire concern is that you're making decisions for children yeah and that this is a completely new thing with no historical precedent we've never done this before there's not like a history of hundreds of years of blocker blockers being used on young children and whether or not that is healthy and promotes a positive life i feel like if a child thinks they're a girl let them live as a girl but you don't have to hormonally engage with their body with chemicals it just seems crazy it seems ill-advised it does it seems like this movement of acceptance and progressive thinking in 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 many ways is a fantastic thing it's a fantastic movement but this seems to me to be a uh, a leap and that you're making this leap to confirm your ideology and to confirm that you know you're a hundred percent cool with trans people and you're a hundred percent cool and you you're gonna recognize this child is trans but you're doing something you're you're doing something to this child's body that you can't turn around and if this child decides at whatever age we decide that you can make rational decisions to transition as trans let them fully develop first let them be a person let them make these decisions <laughs> So when Kamala wins, and when you go into manic spirals, everything you've worked for crumbles around you, uh, what illicit drugs are you going to overdose on? So if Trump wins, what are you going to do to yourself? Uh, I don't know. Probably move to the Netherlands. I don't want to deal with them. Can you answer the question, though? Um, Snowflake? Well, I, I hope that Trump... Answer the question, Snowflake! I hope Trump wins. Kamala answer might win. Answer the question, Let coward, me tell you what happens. Coward. So let me tell you what happens. Uh, if Kamala Harris wins, which she might, him. unlike you, I will not flee have? my country. I will go back to work the next day if Kamala mm -hmm. Harris wins. So unlike you, I will not go to some European socialist nanny state and get out of the way. I will fight harder if Kamala Harris wins. And I am dedicating my life right now to make sure that doesn't happen. To register voters and to chase ballots and to rally the next generation. So unlike you, I'm a participant. And you might be right, Kamala might win. It might be too much. But I'll be able to look my daughter and my son in the eye and say I did everything I possibly could to make sure that this country remained free and prosperous for you guys. Most Kamala supporters really don't have an idea of what they're supporting. Like seriously, if you ask any of them, like clips I've seen, friends have had a discussion with what are policies they don't know any wait what were you saying i believe and it's not just for people who are intersex or yeah. have a certain condition mm -hmm. it goes for everyone however you feel you are that's what you are so if i feel it's like i'm a millionaire your... i'm a millionaire <laughs> yeah that's not exactly that's how that was no but that's, that's not what delusional. i mean i mean it's up to each and every individual person to define who they are I mean, you but you cannot see it your, that way, but that's up, up your to you. They, are, they can still though. be who they are. Uh, yeah. what, what's going on here is not the same right. what's going on yeah, here. Yeah, that's what we're trying to So yeah. what happens is when, you, when there is a, some sort of like disruption between mm. your mind and your body, then that's when you, you get confused. I think that you are born how you're born, and you can't change that. So we can yeah. agree to disagree because I'm not going to change your mind and you guys aren't going to change my mind. No, I'm not trying, not to, trying, I'm to. Not trying to change your mind. I'm just giving you facts. That's yeah. not my opinion. But those aren't necessarily facts. There are You could Google facts. it. It's on there's there. There's research. You when, when you say delusional person, they're going to claim there's research. Or they will claim one professor wrote an article online and that's their research. Like, it's heartbreaking. A man is a man, a woman is a woman. You can change this. And it's... It's sad, but you, you can respect if someone wants to be delusional, you can just respect their wishes, but like, the truth is that a man is a man, a woman is a woman, there's no way you can change that shit, like, as a fact.